Apparently there's been some type of commotion in the stands or somewhere. Well, first up, less than an hour before police say a LaFleur student, D'Angelo Parnell, pulled out a gun and shot nine people inside Lad People Stadium. A possible rumor of a gun circulated through the crowd. Video shows people scrambling, even hiding. But Mobile Police say when they went to check it out, nobody wanted to talk. Shortly after, gunshots. They are down on the ground. Two incidents just an hour apart, both sending adults and children scrambling inside a high school football game at Lad Peebles Stadium. <laughs> One of those incidents we know ended with several teenagers shot. Did you shoot these people, D'Angelo? And 17 year old D'Angelo Parnell behind bars tonight, charged with nine counts of attempted murder. What you typically see in a situation where people will scatter, but they don't tell the police that something occurred. But it's this first incident raising questions. Caught on the live stream from the Mobile County Public School System at the tail end of the third quarter. They are down on the ground. Apparently there's been some type of commotion in the stands or somewhere. Coming when a possible rumor of someone with a gun made its rounds through the crowd and down onto the field. And we can't react to what we don't know that's happening. Mobile police say had witnesses or people who knew a fight was brewing had just spoken up. Maybe the shooting that injured 10 less than an hour later could have been prevented. And so in this particular case, uh, we didn't react because we were not made aware that someone had a gun and something had occurred. At last check, six of the nine people shot are out of the hospital. Chief Batiste says Parnell's bond hearing will likely come tomorrow. We'll stay on top of this shooting as we have the past few days. To stay up to date yourself, keep up with us on air and online.